Hey friend friends, how is being being? It's Saturday. I'm excited because it's Valentine's Day weekend, so it starts love weekend. So me and my husband are celebrating today, and then we're celebrating with the kids slash uh what is it called? What's it called? Super Bowl Sunday slash Usher is in concert live on TV tomorrow. So I just met my mother-in-law to get the kids. The peace and quiet that I had up until I just turned this on and started talking. Girl, my kids were talking a mile a minute. Kenzie had a game this morning. Bean and Maddie both were on one collectively. When we left Kenzie's game, they're all in the car at one time. It was just like chatterbox. And I said, can we just sit in silence, please? And they were like, yeah, sure. And then it started back up. <clears throat> so they're gone. Um, I'm headed back home. Me and my husband have reservations tonight at seven at AG Steakhouse. We've been there before. It's in the Ritz Hotel. It's right across from Fox Theater. It was really good the last time we went. I don't know, I just feel like it's a whole vibe when you can, girl, what are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Are you asleep? Why are you going off the road? I don't know, ma'am. Mm -mm. I don't want any parts. You and Aversa need to get to your freaking destination. Let me go. Hold on, y'all. We gotta pass her. Ooh, she coming on my side! It's on the phone, child. Get off the phone! Anyways. We're gonna try to get there early. I feel like it's a little vibe when you get there, have drinks. I feel like it just sets like a, a nice little tone, get a little lit, then go sit down and have your food and stuff. Mm hmm So we're gonna do that. Our reservation should be over. It's, if it's at seven, we should probably wrap up like around 9.30, 10 o'clock, just depends. We like dessert when we go out and dine together. Appetizers, meal, dessert. And this is not a spot, it's not one of the restaurants in Atlanta that be like you only got a two hour time limit which pisses me off to no end because why are you rushing my reservations two hours some some establishments they don't care how large your party is they having a two hour max because they're trying to turn them tables and make more money and to me that automatically puts a dent in the dining experience because why how do i have time to sit down order my drink catch a vibe figure out what i want maybe i want an appetizer i want to eat that Decide what I want for dinner, you go put that in, bring my dinner out. I want to sit there and let my dinner digest just a smidget. Kiki, laugh it up, order another drink. Like they don't give you time to do all of that. And then to me, it just ruins the experience because I'm sitting here thinking about the fact that I'm looking at you, looking at me like it's time for y'all to get up. As opposed to the restaurants that allow you to just dine and you go whenever it's time for you to go because they want you to come back. I just passed the police officer. Is it illegal to vlog? I don't know. Anyways, I feel like we're gonna have a good time. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit because I think it's gonna be cute. I'm gonna put me some like, I really want some really bouncy curls in my hair, you know? Just to, just let them go. You know what I'm saying? Cut them in all. Do my edges cause, you know? Yeah, I think it's gonna be fun. And then tomorrow, I'm gonna include all this in the video. Cause y'all finna hear me talk today. In a hat. I'll talk to y'all a little bit later. I feel like my skin's on glow, is it? <laughs> Turn on the lights. They looking for me too. <laughs> so friends, I'm about to, ooh y'all, as crooked as they come. Mm-mm. I'm about to fill up my water bottle because I need to be hydrated. So I plan on having me a couple drinky drinks tonight. And I don't want to be hungover tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good day. Anyways, the girls are serving the looks. New York Fashion Week. Right now on Instagram, if y'all not follow any of them, Jaleesa Yvonne always steps, even when she be at the house. Just the stuff that she just, her normal content, I be like, oh girl, I like that. And tell y'all, but I think I might be starting a contract that requires me to go into office probably like one or two times a week. I'm kind of excited about it, but the anxiety that I've been having, thinking about the fact that I have to be around people, it's been four years since I had to actually be in a professional setting. I don't even know how to turn on my corporate voice anymore. Hi, how are you? Yes, my name's Janae. Mm -hmm. No, I don't even know how to do it anymore. 
I don't want to do it anymore. I've become very laxed, very comfortable with having a lax, is it vernacular, vocabulary, girl, whatever. I just don't want to be like, even the corporate lingo just does something to my soul. Anyways, what are we talking about? The girls in New York Fashion Week. Yeah, oh my gosh, the outfits though are just gorgeous. Really love it. Some of the other girls, Janae Naylor, Brittany from Pockets and Bows. Um, who else? Who else did I see? Oh, the Yusufs, the, the sisters. Um, is her name Chi? Style by Chi? Something like that. All of them. I just love seeing the black women in New York killing it with the outfits, living their best luxurious lives. Anyways, I'm about to go drink on my water. <laughs> I might start editing a little bit. It's already 1.30. So I'm not gonna have long. Maybe I should just relax. I need to drink my water though. Who is that? I think it's Jehovah Witnesses going door to door. Not me twerking while I said that. All right. Let me just show y'all the stuff that I've collected. I've already showed y'all this, but I'm gonna go ahead and put their bags together. I got each of them one of these. What's their names on the bottom of these? The mini. These little white chocolate hearts. I don't even know what flavor these are. I just got, oh, strawberries and cream. As if they don't already have enough of this. Remember I bought these a while back when I first got all of my Valentine's Day stuff? So, I feel bad. I need to go find some stuff for me. Hey friends, we're going to Target because I feel like my baby need more stuff in her little bag. I feel some type of way. So, I'll show you what I get. That was the worst idea ever. Target is busier than it is on Black Friday. Kid y'all not. Everybody and their mom is in here. The lines were long. They had to even open up extra lines. I'm about to go home and pin curl my hair. Cause it'd be voluptuous, child. I don't even want it to be like perfectly placed curls. I just want it to be like, oh. what'd you say? And it's like I had outside. It is 66 degrees. So let me show y'all what I got. So I didn't get Valentine's Day pajamas for Kenzie and Maddie. I was going to go to Old Navy yesterday, but I just did not have it in me. So I got them, these cute ones. They're strawberries. So I think this will be cute. Bean already has hers. I also got, um, since Bean didn't get a Pandora bracelet, which I think I might do that for her third birthday. I got her this cute little thing. She's going to be number lose it. And I'm thinking if I might get her a Pandora bracelet. But I feel like she would. My nose dry. Um, I would make sure she kept up with that. Is there anything else in here? Oh, the ballerina shoes I got to go on her little ballerina section thing. And then eventually she'll use them because I do want to get her in ballet. She'll do salt balls. She'll do everything. I just got some of these little sugar cookies because the kids really like these. My brightness is so high. And I'm on my phone, by the way. Phone quality, okay? So if it's the it same, y'all know why. And then I got, um... Kenzie and Maddie, Robots gift cards. I got Bean a little Target gift card. It's only $5 on here just so. She's at the page, where is mine? So I'm gonna bring her Target and let her find her something. I got these little greeting cards because I want to write a little no love note to each of my kids as well as my husband. So it just says, with a grateful heart, and I feel like that's on brand. And the inside of it is blank. Bean has been asking me to go to Target and buy her a phone. What? Why is it so bright? So I got her this little phone because the one she currently has is similar to this. It's broke. So her screen doesn't come on. I didn't even check to see if this... Okay, it worked. Um, I got more tissue paper to go on the smaller bag. I got some of these because I love these. So I'm going to put these down in their bag. And then lastly, I just bought some paint for them to paint the little hearts because I didn't show y'all. Once I get everything together, I'll show it to y'all. So I just got pink and red. I feel like I'm always buying paint oh and then i got each of them their own little elf chapstick so originally when i showed kenzie and maddie mine they were like why don't you get us one so here i am getting them one and then obviously bean so that she can spit all on her own and not spit on mine so that's everything i got let's go home
Hey friends, I'm gonna start the TikTok. Y'all can't even see me. It's dark. Anyways, let's go to dinner. Hey friends, get ready with me to go out to dinner and drinks with my husband for Valentine's Day. <laughs> Ain't she so cute? Denim number. It also comes in blue denim anyway. So I'm gonna put them on with these. No, I am not gonna put on socks with these because I don't feel like it. <laughs> Petite girls can wear knee high boots too. They just gonna go up to your Oh, the love you earrings from Zara. So you read from right to left, right? So, oh my God, she's playing music while I'm trying to do this. Y'all did it. Talk to me now. Talk to me. So I also got these from Zara uh, a while back. I don't remember when. I feel like this looks better. Now let's do the hair. I literally just spent the last 10 minutes trying to find this damn comb. Right, here goes nothing. Oh, I'll take the wig off now. You do her. And you don't like my hair? Keep it to yourself. Okay, so this is what we're doing for our fragrance. Kayali Eden plus Tom Ford Lush Cherry. Thanks to Kyra Armani for the recommendation. I already put it all over my body. I'm about to put it all over my outfit because you need to be able to smell me with or without my clothes on. Don't play. Do not play. Mm-hmm. Woo! Yes, Lord. Oh, I smell so good. If you ain't never tried it, try it. Not me coming to talk to y'all without putting on my lip. Don't know anything about makeup, which y'all can probably tell. But anyways. This is the bag. This is the outfit. I think she cute. Tyler's on. The car is outside, aka our car is parked in the garage. So it's time to go. See y'all at dinner. Bye. No other way to say it ain't that complicated. I keep dropping his like water breaking two centimeters. Wake up in the morning. Think you'll be on the line. Eyes are so swollen. <laughs> we about to go get some food. Somebody said stop doing this. What? Not it's not to me, but on TikTok they was talking about millennials and Gen Zs and stuff. Last night was a ball. We'll have to talk about it. I'm about to get ready to edit y'all. Not edit y'all. Edit the video today. Oh my god. I look a I know why my face is swollen, y'all. I slept in my little lashes last night. Look at them show. <laughs> we went to AG Steakhouse last night, like I told y'all, and, and they have this drink that has egg whites in it. It puts like the little foam up at the top. It was called Purple Haze. It was really good. It had gin in it. And then we also ordered a Ritz 181, which is like, I guess their take on a French 75. They didn't have any lemon in it. No, I think French 75s have a little bit of lemon juice in it. It was like straight gin and champagne. And it was just, I was like, I'm gonna be drunk. So I let my husband have it. And I just had two of the purple hazes. And we had their signature um, um, dessert, which is a peach fuzz bowl. <laughs> it's called the Georgia Peach. <laughs> it was good too. But we're about to go get some, um, um, breakfast from daily grind my husband ordered his food on uber eats but i'm just i'm feeling like a muffin and some coffee you ever watch the marvel movies in order if you haven't you should it's actually very interesting because they they actually supposed to go in a certain order anyways and then we're gonna go get our kids and start our valentine's day festivities and then we'll transition over into the super bowl <laughs> anyways i'm just gonna make sure. yeah um yeah, I'll talk to you guys in a Jeff afterwards. But I'm gonna record the stuff from today, and then that's how we'll kind of play it out. <laughs> oh,
short wig on baby she is uneven obviously because it's cut to be like a bust down with a pull but it's okay if my hairstyles would have did it she would have cut it even back whatever just throw this one on beautiful here yeah, no this makes my um cheeks look bigger i need to put my sunscreen on where is my sunscreen anyways i really want to get my nails redone because i'm just over this glitter in here Tomorrow's Valentine's Day, which means all of the Valentine's Day decor is coming down after tomorrow. It's been up long enough. It's been a month and a half that I've had my Valentine's. It's not a lot, so it's not like it's irritating me, but whatever. So anyways, as I was in my closet this morning, this is what I put on. This sweatshirt, which I've seen a million times, and these jeans, which I got from PacSun. They have been big and loose, but I went to put on some of my um, American Eagle jeans. Baby, they don't fit. They fit that child. And they're size zero. I'm like, why do I have a pair of jeans in here that are size zero? But that lets you know just how much clothes I have that I haven't worn in a really long time that I didn't realize that I've actually grew from. And I don't see myself ever getting back in those. But they kind of cute. It's just I can't breathe with them on. She don't like them because they don't fit. They fit kind of like loose art and they're mom jeans. She's like, I'm not a mom. So she doesn't want to wear them. So yeah, she likes skinny jeans. You didn't wear it in 2023? What's this year? 2023? They have not grabbed for it the last couple of months of this year? Call it. Because my closet is stuffed to the brim with clothes that I haven't been wearing. That's been the whole strategy, y'all, with um, me doing this whole, if you don't follow me on TikTok, you have no clue what I'm talking about. So basically I told myself that I was not allowed to buy more clothes unless um, I styled and wore everything that's in my closet currently. So the things I wear over and over again, obviously I'm gonna keep. But stuff I'm skipping over, I just need to go ahead and get rid of it and make room for the new dish. But I just got very comfortable wearing like sweats and stuff all the time because I'm always in the house. But I need freaking clothes. So, I said all that to say, bit about go shower. <laughs> all right, so anyways, I have, um, I'm making my to-do list. I use the to-do-ist app. So, Purge Closet, I need to record reels today. I already have it on here to um, schedule IG posts for the week. I haven't done that yet. Um, what else do I need to do today? Ooh, respond to emails. So. First thing we're gonna do top of the morning is take our vitamins. <laughs> take your vitamins. And then y'all know I went to the Daily Grind the other day to get my cinnamon roll. I showed y'all that, but I didn't did that actually y'all. Actually, no, that's a part of this vlog. So I split the vlogs up. So I don't know how short or long this vlog is gonna be, but basically 
I showed y'all the cinnamon roll. I also got this. I got this on Saturday. Is it still some good? It's equivalent to me going to the grocery store on Saturday and waiting to eat my muffin on Tuesday. So yeah, it's this one. Um, it is a harvest muffin. So it smells like carrot cake, but it has like apples. Is, did she say cranberries? I don't know, but I'm gonna eat around those. Anyways, I'm gonna warm her up. Then I'm gonna have her with a cup of joe, okay? And then after we do that, we're gonna do a little bit of um, sprucing up to our countertops. I'm gonna show you guys what I've done so far. Um, and then we're just gonna go from there. Okay, good morning. <laughs> did you say good morning? Anyways, we're gonna microwave her. I didn't touch my camera with this one. What in the world is going on with my hair? It's getting like a little flip number. I, I was telling my daughter this morning that I was thinking about being a straight hair natural because I'm just over my little wigs and stuff. My forehead is big and beautiful. Anytime I make an insult to myself, I told myself that I have to follow up with a compliment or stop myself from making the insult and just compliment myself. So. I like to wash my real hair, but not not just doing this around your licking. It's bouncing. That's because it's fake hair. It's big hair. Fake. Girl, you are a hater. Did y'all hear that? It said because it's fake hair. It be your own sure. I just created a reel. I don't know if I like it. I haven't even edited it, but the footage individually I like, but collectively I'm like, girl. Anyways, my body's about to die. Let me tell y'all around, show y'all what I've done so far. It's very minimal in the kitchen, which I really like. And I feel like our kitchen has been just a kitchen and not actually styled when we're not actually using it. So I tried to solve that problem today. So I'm gonna turn you guys around, let you see it. Hopefully the battery doesn't die. If it does, we'll just change it and keep it moving. Hold on. All right, so. This is what her kitchen's looking like. Hopefully she's good and focused. So, right here, I finally am using this bad boy. This is was over in my little um, conversation area, but I might actually end up using this in Bean's room. This is the one I was telling y'all about, but for now she fits perfectly down in yonder. Pulled up, battery died, back in action. But anyways, yeah, I might end up using this in Bean's room. And then I pulled this candle out from my little candle stash. We're gonna burn her until she is no longer. So this is where I decided to use one of my little William Sonoma dupes. I think it looks really good. It blends in with the countertop, but it's like elevating the countertop. And I think that's so cute and very springish. Yes, we're in the mode of prepping. Right here, I decided to bring these down from our bathroom. So this one says hand wash, the other one says lotion. Obviously we need one that says soap or something like that. So I'm planning on ordering another one. I'll probably end up moving this one somewhere else, but I do think it's fine, good to have lotion down here after we wash our hands, washing dishes and all that kind of jazz. This also matches the, uh, let me show y'all. I like how they now match these. So the black was just a little bit heavy. They're sitting right there in the sink. Um, the black matches obviously, but I feel like because I brought out the wood tones, these look better. So then right here, I have my dead roses that I need to change out, my home goods pot. This was just like this for the purpose of doing my reel, but I like how that looks. I showed y'all this in the last vlog. And then over here, I decided to put a spring type candle out. I don't know if y'all noticed, but the Valentine's Day stuff is gone, okay? Um, my little organic bowl. This is giving an organic moment over here. I feel like the marble didn't really go with the vibes, but it's okay. So until I find another little candle holder that probably sits a little bit lower, I think this is actually cute. And we have all of our cookbooks out. So whenever we want to use them, they're handy. I don't have anything right here, but I actually like the fact that we have open counter space because I don't like a lot of clutter. And the way that I originally had it, I want to insert what this looks like. Maybe that footage, what the original world looked like. But it was just very crowded to me. So I like this. And then she pretty much stayed the same with the exception of me getting rid of the pink stuff that was over here. So that's E, that's the update. Ignore that, it's always something on the stairs. So I'm about to get ready to edit this reel to see what she looks like 
see if we like the what's the name. I ended up Flea Hope. I apologize if this tablet is very loud. She lives there, so. Um, I ended up not using these, even though I really like these. And it's that thick glass, too. So they're really good quality. It actually says premium quality handmade. And they were only $5.99. And I also love the lids of them, but if I'm being honest, I don't really need these. And I could sit these right here. Y'all let me know what y'all think. I won't take them back until after y'all see this video. But I could put them right here. But my issue is that if I sit these right here, and let me the other If I sit these right here and I end up putting the flower and whatever in them, am I gonna later down the line be like, I don't need these out on the counter? You know what I'm saying? Let me show you what it looks like standing back. I don't think that looks bad. But she's not part of the reel, so. But I could put it right there. It's just, is it just something else to be in the way? You know what I'm saying? So y'all let me know what y'all think. Otherwise, I might end up taking these back or potentially just keeping these in my pantry somewhere because I feel like these are really nice, you know? Also, I don't think I've mentioned to y'all, after that video where I had styled the bookshelves over here, I decided to just remove everything off the counters. I actually made myself a note on my to-do list, y'all, I forget. Is this even focused? Is it? I can't tell, I think my eyes are blurry. But, um, yeah, I made myself a note on the to-do list to specifically remove everything off of there because these flips, I actually curled my hair and combed it out and this is what I was left with. I don't hate it, but you know, I do like that my natural hair actually blends with it so we can do a little number light bump. <laughs> so anyways, yeah, we need to um, get our bookshelves and that's my hand doing that guys i'm not passing gas i'm calm so yeah what i am about to do is bring out my spring florals because i feel like it's necessary i'm in full blown spring mode i don't care how cold it gets again here y'all bane did that she brought that down from her her room y'all this is my victoria's secret blanket oh i did not know it had this on the inside it's similar to the blanket i was showing y'all that my mother-in-law got me girl I need to fix me something to eat and curl up on my couch and watch TV while I edit my what's next. How about, let's talk about it. I'm going to Usher concert. So I never got a chance to go see Usher in, this is my world here, not blending. I never got to go see Usher in concert in Vegas, right? No biggie. I want to see him, but it's the end of the world. And we brought Lynn out on stage at the Super Bowl. I was like, oh yes, I definitely, I, I know every Usher song from back in the day. I used to listen to his song and how I used to learn songs when I was coming up, I used to actually have my little notebook and I would literally write them down word for word based on what I thought. I know pretty much all of those songs. But I was like, I need to learn his current song so I can be like singing those anyways. Said all of that to say, I, I really feel like this is not fun. I said all of that because I went online yesterday at 10 o'clock in the morning to get tickets to his concert. Girl, $1,500 a ticket. Six, the lowest I seen was like $507 per ticket and that was not close up. So then I was like, let me just see how much it costs in Miami because me and my husband love going to Miami and they were like half the price. And I think what it is is because Atlanta is his hometown. So I just bought the tickets for Miami. So we're gonna do that. But he added more dates for August here in Atlanta. So I was like, I want to see him here in Atlanta. Girl, I went on there and it was pre-sale. I was like, you know what? So anyways, y'all let me know if y'all are, if y'all like Usher and if y'all plan on going to any of his concerts. That's the story about Usher. But some people were saying they didn't even like his performance on the Super Bowl. You have to be a certified hater to think that. Cause why? What you ain't like about it? He was skating. So people said the costumes look cheap, da da da. Girl, how did he perform? Only oh, good, good, but we still. Hey. I hate that we didn't make it to forever. Probably ain't getting back together. But that don't mean that I can't wish you better. We good, good, but we still good. I realize that I can't be your lover. Let's just keep it honest with each other. I'll be happy for you when you find another We ain't good, good, but we 
step, we step Happy Wednesday, happy Valentine's Day. I think we're about to get ready to go to Target really quickly and I'm highly contemplating taking myself on a solo date because I'm trying to think of things that I wanna to do today for myself for Valentine's Day. Me and my husband already celebrated. Obviously we're cooking dinner tonight um, to celebrate again officially for Valentine's Day. I kinda of wanna go on a solo date. That's one of my goals this month is to go on a solo date. Obviously it's only the 14th so I still have time to do that but what better time then Valentine's Day. So anyways, this is my outfit. This cardigan doesn't really go with my outfit. But girl, put your pants back up. These cargos are from Ignore. I did my hair this morning even though I didn't wash it. But these cargos are from PacSun. This t-shirt is American Eagle. This sweater, which just kept me warm, is Zara. And then I have on these. I think these are ducks. Um, they're like a pink-ish type color matches the shirt so this is the outfit so let's go ask my husband if he has any meetings for the rest of the day because i do not plan on taking y'all's niece okay that i'm not doing please don't fall all right friends we're on our way we're about to catch these vibes and target it is so nice outside my thing temperature thing in my car says 62 degrees i really feel like this camera's gonna fall can afford cannot afford Okay, the camera, not the camera, the car says it's going to be it's 62 degrees outside. I was going to take myself on a little solo day, but I might hold off and do that another day because since it's so nice, I think I might, when I get back home, change it to my little pink athleisure outfit, which got a hole in it. I have to show y'all that girl. Pissed because I've never worn it. Um, and like go for a walk, me and Vane, and then like around 5 o'clock, change it to like run me a bubble bath, change it to my pajamas my um valentine's day pajamas um have me a glass of wine and then we're making homemade sushi tonight and just let it be a whole little vibe i'm planning on doing it earlier just because once we get out of dinner and then everybody's getting their baths we're getting being ready for for nighttime it's just like everybody's needs need to be met again at nighttime and it's just very hard for me to focus on me time like i don't enjoy my showers anymore i don't know the last time i actually took me a bubble bath and i just need to do that today and hopefully today is the start of something a new one where we're actually like pouring back into ourselves because i just really miss doing that why you had to get in front of me why you got to be in front of me every time i get in this freaking car i swear to god it's always something with a goddamn car if you don't drive so I can get over. I don't want to be stuck behind this car either. Anyways, these large head kids are out of school next week for some break. So I also need to make sure I get them some snacks when I well that's my whole point going to Target is to get my snacks. Um because public snacks be hit or miss. Sometimes it's about one get one, the other times we talking about fifteen dollars for a box of twelve pack crackers, and that's just not gonna cut it for me. So yeah, that's some of my whole point going over here, but I am gonna go to Athleisure where I am gonna go to other areas in there so I can see what I have, see if I'm gonna bring something home, okay? Um, Y'all remind me to get some iron pills while I'm in here because these eyes are starting to get dark again. My energy is very, very low. I don't know what's going on, but I'm just gonna attribute it to low iron because I always have low iron. And I don't think it's I'm getting enough of it in my multivitamin, so there's that. Anyhow! I've edited this video. I've literally spent my entire morning cutting up on my couch, editing this video so that it can go live today. So I plan on doing whatever the rest of the stuff I'm doing today and adding that in there to go live probably like around seven to eight o'clock tonight. And then maybe for the rest of the week, we end up just doing like a weekend vlog. And then next week we start back with regularly scheduled programs. So hopefully Wednesday, we can do like Kenzie's bathroom, potentially Bean's accent wall, and all that kind of stuff in Wednesday's video. And then next Sunday, we're back to our normal weekly vlogs. Did I tell y'all? Pending the results of my drug and background check, um, I will be starting a contract potentially next Wednesday or that following Monday. So hopefully I'll still be able to vlog, but y'all will be able to go in and out of the office with me. Obviously I'm not vlogging while I'm in the office, but you know, like, not like that. So, 
Janae goes back to the office. Wow. I was just telling y'all, I don't know how to feel about it. Anyways, I'm going to quit. I've been talking a lot this vlog, so I'm going to go ahead and hang this one up, and I'll see y'all in Target. Serious question. Why does Oatly have three different versions of their milk? Don't come out with a better version. That's optional. Make all of them better. I don't want to choose. I want the good one. One, two, three. I don't know. But what's wrong with you girls? I feel like y'all don't need love. You need somebody who could micromanage you. You know what I'm saying? Tell you right from wrong. Who's smart from who's a fool. What's utensil to use for what's food? Like, I got a schedule to attend to, though. I can't really. We just finished, well, I just finished my bath. And then Bean comes to my bathroom and says, look, mommy. And she comes in there with tissue, just, or wipes, stuff between her legs, where she tried to change herself. Anyways, we have on our Valentine's Day pajamas. About to go downstairs and have dinner. I had the best freaking, what do I feel like I look weird? I had the best freaking, um, that's where you got the word freaking from. Hmm. She been saying, mommy, give me my. Freaking, freaking chicken nuggets. So anyways, had the best bath time. Did you have a good bath time? You eat with us. Happy Valentine's Day. <laughs> so we're about to go downstairs and eat dinner. And I'm gonna edit the rest of this video so it can go live. Probably, it's 6.49 now, so it can go live by late 8 o'clock. It's pretty much done. I've been editing all morning. It's but not all my little girls done failed, child. I need to wash my hair. That's what I was supposed to do tonight. I was supposed to wash my hair in the shower. It's okay. Tomorrow, B has culinary class. So, we'll start another vlog tomorrow. But, we're about to go downstairs and have our homemade sushi and stuff. And then, we're going to go to sleep for the night. My wine has been good. YouTube has been good. I feel like I look so greasy right now. Eels them. This is because I moisturized the heck out of my face. This is Skin Fix and... Whatever this stuff, the wool stuff is. Look at the hair. Look at that. Mm. Mm -hmm. Anyways, so we're going to close out the vlog right here. I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. It's a little bit chatty. It was a little bit chatty. I ain't going to hold you. But it's okay. And let me show y'all what the um, pajamas look like. These are from Victoria's Secret. I normally get an extra small in their pajamas, but I got these in a size small. They are super long, so they're not short girl friendly, but they're super cute and they're super comfortable okay what mommy what's that they go in the back anyways i hope y'all had an amazing valentine's day and hope all y'all had a really good what though for lady you treated yourself nicely mean is over here having a good time with dog on back i should have watched you a bag for valentine's day and nothing else anyways y'all hope you had an amazing time we'll see you guys i'm gonna push my hair we'll see you guys on sunday Boy, say bye bye, Beanie. Bye. Say bye, friends. Bye, friends. <laughs>